Hey guys, welcome back to another roll racing video, but we're doing two videos. Yeah, the reason being, there's just so many cars here. It is a big, big night, and not just a lot of cars, there's a lot of very cool and exciting cars. So I'm hoping that I can jump in with you first. We'll get some 17T action. Which will be in the 17T video. And I just want to say the other reason we do this is often the roll race videos end up at like 45, <laughs> 15 minutes long. So we'll try and split it into two videos this time, two 20 minutes. You know, we've got Tim, Scott, and a lot of other cars that I really would like to as I'm not driving today. I want to try and jump in with them and try and catch some action so you can actually see what goes on in the other cars as well, not just the 060 cars. Anyway. I'm getting, I'm getting excited. It's nearly time to go. It's, I can't believe how dark it is so early, but the track is about to open. You better get this thing warmed up and let's head out. Let's do it. Cool. All right, hit the limiter. Holy shit. Holy just moly. Just M5. Just holy crap. Absolutely smoked him. I'm really Woo! surprised. So I've jumped in the car with, sorry Scott, I'm gonna put your blinding interior lights on for a second. I've jumped in with Scott, who's now rocking 19 T's, and was it, you said it was last night, you were, you were still talking to HCs, doing your tune? Yeah, still tuning last night. Jesus, talk about last minute rush, but it's all, it's car's pretty happy now, you've got that extra meth nozzle? Yep, yep, running uh, 855cc. Oof, nice, that's gonna, that should... two nozzles. Oh, something doesn't, is that smoking? I think it might be vaping, to be honest. <laughs> Easy mistake, you know. <laughs> um, but we'll, um, I can, are you gonna maybe do a test, a test 40 hit? Yeah, why not? Yeah, see what it's like, because you also rock an AR1s as well? Yes. I'll turn your lights off so you can see what you're doing. Boost it up. Nice. Oh, well, there's the uh, check engine light. Ah. So what I'll do is I'll just reset the, um, Lambda control. Okay. I had a feeling this might happen. Okay, well, Scott has lined up behind Tim, so no messing him out, but this race is a twin turbo Hurricane versus Mr. 35, not a Hurricane and R8. And that was really, really close. Mr. 35 might have just reeled him in. I think so. Yep. So, finally, a car has come in that might be able to beat Mr. 35. Hopefully we can get some of those races from outside. And if you've been watching the channel, you know Tim now has the DAW Big Boys. So his car's pretty quick, so this is going to be a pretty good test to see how the China 19Ts go. So I think the plan here is brake boost and let it loose. All right, you're going to go brake boost as well? Yep. Whoa, okay, we spun up big time. But at least we can get a misfire. Yeah, she rang pretty clean, but when the power come in, it um, I just I felt the whole car step sideways yeah. pretty aggressively. And you did you back off? Yeah, I have yeah, to get it back under control. Yeah. Maybe we might be able to get another run, maybe. I think so. Okay, because we it turns out Tim spun up big time as well last time, so now we're having a rerun against Tim. All right, no brake boosting this time, we'll, unless I have to. Quickly. Yeah. Okay, we're back in the lineup and made a couple of changes to second gear. Mm. Yeah, we decided to try uh, boost by gear and set it at 15 psi. 15 because it was hitting 26 odd in second. Yeah. And it looks like 
particularly when you're in a race, it, as soon as it comes into boost, onto boost, it just goes bam, um, jumps up to 26 PSI, fries the rear tires, clips the limiter, and uh, throws a check engine light. And that's yeah. why all the races were so bad. So hopefully at 15 PSI, that'll limit the power, limit the wheel spin, um, be a bit more controllable, hopefully not even spin the tires up. That'd be good if you can just put mm. the power down. And 15 PSI on 19 Ts in this weather mm. should still be pretty quick. Yeah, yeah, I think so. It's, I mean, it's got to be better than, than hitting limiter and not going anywhere. That's a good point, yeah. And then grab third and it's, you know, there's no limiting in third gear, so it yeah. should be a weapon in third. Yeah, the, the log we did in third gear just now was perfect. It did, yeah. We went down the back straights and it was, the everything on, on the log just looked perfect. So everything's happy. It's just, it's, it's just breaking loose in second, clipping the limiter and shutting down. Cool, this time we are up against a Porsche Boxster S. You gotta say, it actually looks pretty cool out on the racetrack. It does, it does indeed. I, I like the Boxsters. Yeah, I wouldn't mind good. one myself, to be honest. Probably rocking a PDK gearbox, there'll be rapid shifts. Won't be clipping the limiter and throwing a throwing a check engine light. No. Got to got to try and avoid the limiter at all costs on this run. Yep. I'm feeling good. <laughs> well, the Porsche is quick. It sounds yeah. awesome. And it clipped limiter again. I did. In the, Back in a limp mode. I was just going. Sorry, Tim, I'm going to blind you for a second. Yeah. Okay. I don't know where the first three quarters of the night's gone, <laughs> but it's I'm in Tim's car now, and we just made it back on track in time for the start of eliminations. Um, we've got the windows up because the Commodore next to us is the loudest car I've <laughs> ever heard. He's probably going to do a big power skid. Jesus. Wow, that's loose, man. That's... This, I've been looking forward to getting this car all night to see what the, all the hype is about with these DAWs, and that was, like, just felt really clean, but it just absolutely fried the tyres. It smacked limiter a couple of times. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right, here comes the drag car. Let's do a bit of brake boost, mate. Here we go. Oh. Whoa. Woo. Okay, it, it, was, it spun up pretty hardcore then, didn't it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I could feel it. But um, I mean, I don't. Even if you had a perfect run, I don't think you're gonna. Get it. <laughs> that thing is a monster. He might go pretty deep into the uh, into the eliminations, but when it's actually hooked up in uh, in, in third gear and then got to the top third and you grab fourth, yeah, that was pulling really strong. Yeah, like my feet were coming off the <laughs> my feet were coming off the floor, man. It was hooking. It's fast. Should we go to a little third down there and yes. pretend we're in? Show me what she's like. <laughs> I can't say no to that. Have a pretend roll race. Yeah. <laughs> Does that is for sure. You reckon? That, yeah. My left foot, 100. <laughs> that was pulling my left foot off the off, the, off the foot well. <laughs> and you, you must have gone from third as you grab fourth gear. It yeah. went back on the ground and then come off again. Come and back fourth. Up. Yeah, right. Well, it, that feels awesome. But it's it just, like it. 
Your second gear is useless, hey? Yeah. It just, yeah. yeah. You get to like three and a half or something, it's just bang. Gold. It was all right on the last couple of runs we did once we've been around a couple of times with Andrew. Yeah, it got some heat into yeah, everything. Yeah, a bit of heat, so. It's, the, the, it's got to be the busiest roll race, what well, is, the busiest roll race at night I've ever been to by far. The cars here, I mean, they're not just like an insane calibre. There are so many of them. Um, and yeah, that, that, like we just made out for that eliminations run and we were queuing up for, felt like 20 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> and when it's like 10 degrees out or nine degrees outside, yep. yeah, the tires would have been pretty, pretty cold. <laughs> but that was a lot of fun. So thanks for actually taking me for a burn in it. So That's I can right. see what all the hype was about on these bloody <laughs> new big turbos. Try and get out a bit more next yeah. time. Yeah, looking forward to it. Cool.